Hey guys, it's Hero. Some people ask me about how I was crafting, smelting, and refining without clicking the green button in my recent smithing video. One person told me there were frame drops in the video, as it wasn't showing me clicking the button. Tail Worlds changed this a few times, but currently, on PC, you can hit the spacebar to accept or confirm the current action. Basically, using the spacebar will click the green button. You can use both the green button and the spacebar at the same time, rapidly, to get things done faster. Smelting. You can select the weapon to smelt and hit the spacebar. It speeds up the tedious process of only using the mouse to, to go up and select the weapon, go down, hit smelt, select the weapon, hit smelt. Instead, select the weapon, hit the spacebar. But that's only if you're targeting certain weapons to smelt. If you don't care which weapon, you just want to get it done, Clicking the green button and hitting the spacebar rapidly at the same time will make short work of all of it. With forging, there's a similar challenge. You had to click the green button to forge, then move over and click the done button. Forge done, forge done. If you hit the spacebar once to forge, and once for done, it's faster. Or you can click the forge button rapidly and hit the spacebar rapidly to speed through forging. And with refining, you only need to select the option to refine and use either the spacebar or clicking the refine button or both rapidly. This action used to be tied to the enter key, but that conflicted with showing the log window, so Tail Worlds changed it. If you're watching my smithing video and noticed I wasn't clicking the button, it's because I was hitting the spacebar. I have to make a conscious effort to not use hotkeys while recording, so you can see exactly what I'm doing. It doesn't always work. Sometimes I'm in the moment and fall back into habits. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Peace out.